Hey guys, welcome back to another edition of WWE Supercard. I'm your host, Aaron Mitchell, and today I'll give you a quick update to my King Ring. I lost 3 2 here, but I won game one. Couldn't didn't energize the first game because I was I didn't energize in the first two games because I was not at home. Here, I didn't energize the first one either because I totally forgot about it. Then I energized those two. So, yeah. So, it's definitely through to the final since between me and Timbo. So yeah, let's go to man superstars. The architect Seth Rollins, when his king ring is done, will be able to be proed. HBK is about halfway done now, so he needs still a lot more to do. So we're getting to um, ring domination. Team Addy, as you know, the main card is Neville. We've in fact finished Neville. Oh, we're nearly done with cast as well. So let's get through the shout outs. We've got Irfan with 50 shards. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Irfan Sabah. We've got Dcast316 with 51 shards. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Deeper and Rock and Metal. We've got Fireproof with 21 shards. Manuel with 17 shards. Wendell with 17 shards. So there's the top 5. I've got 15 shards. We've got Crispy with 14. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Crispy Crazy Card. We've got Sway with 12. Go and check out his YouTube channel, Sway Codoso. We've got Renato 11 and Sunny D with 7. So yeah, let's go and check out their channels, guys. Sure. Yeah, and again, to some gameplay tour of Supercard. Probably play Barrow as well on my main uh, second account. So, yeah, just be my attacker with Shawn Michaels, chuck him in the middle all the time because it seems to be not. I don't think I've actually lost. With Michaels, which is quite cool. So yeah, and obviously, if you don't already know, the new update for Slam is out with um, base uh, twenty seventeen base cards. The design on them does look really, really cool. Hopefully, every chance is HK or James Ellsworth. So yeah. Um. Fast and Furious 8 is out two weeks today. It was on my sister's birthday, funny enough. I d did not realize until yesterday I was out in two weeks when I was making plans with one of my friends to go and watch it. Realized it's out on the 12th of April, which is two weeks today or Wednesday. I have two t weeks today or two weeks tomorrow. So, yeah, so hopefully I can get a bit more lucky with the shards because 15 shards ain't exactly the best. Yep, I see that I have a full shard. So, yeah. Big cast is a single, and obviously Neville is. But hey, maybe I'm lucky. And maybe I could get Neville Pull. I wouldn't mind the Neville Pull because it actually seems like decent tier. Ta um, decent tier um, card. So, yeah, ooh, trading something now. So, yeah, last night there was like angles happening with ladders to do with. Seamus Cesaro versus Enzo and Cass versus Gallows and Anderson. I've just read an article now via Facebook that apparently there's rumours of that match being made a triple threat match at Mania and somehow inserting the Hardys into that angle where the Hardys actually win the tag titles. That would be interesting because you know ladder matches. Um, that's what Hardys are mainly known for. So maybe we'll see the Hardys return when a raw tag title is mean. Do you respect I don't know if that they may return. And when the SmackDown tag titles, because as it stands, the Usos currently do not have any opponents for WrestleMania. Although they probably will put them in a match with American Alpha, most likely, because they seem the only logical choice to put in that match. So two shards there. Lucky, we're only three shards off. Big Cass, maybe for lucky, um, we may be able to finish Cass off on camera. So yeah, working my way. Back up the leaderboards. I really unlucky lucky finding shards. Yes, at one point I was only on three shards, which was terrible. I'd be, be really unlucky. 
seems to happen a lot with me all, for some reason. Seems like I'm unlucky on my main account finding shards, but then I do quite well finding shards on my second account, which is really annoying because obviously I want to do well for my main account team. Not, I'm not saying that I don't want to do well for my second account, I want to do well for both accounts, but obviously my main account I need to do well there because it's a top tier account. And I want to work my way to get the cards on both accounts, which is annoying when I'm lucky on one and not on the other. Because, it, because obviously I want to do well on both. Yeah, I may not always find the same shards, but I still want to do well. So, yeah. Brock Desner, Daniel Bryan, yes, yes, yes. Table. Edge, Honesty. Toughness. And Charlotte. So no shard found there. I'm going to play these two bouts and then we'll go across to my second account to play some games there. We are done with the ultimate big cast there. That's the first card we're on. We are now onto the elite Randy Orton. Both of them are singles, but I don't mind. I kind of mucked up my pulls. Well, yes, there's rumours that the pull glitch was back and never went too sure. So I said I'll attempt it on my... Um, second account to see if it is back and it ain't so I won't be getting a pull there probably for a while now but I'm not too bothered about the pull there because I'm get I'm get, starting to get up my casual events now and I've got the Elite Pro Dawson to work on I've got a hard infusion there going at the moment and a, a hard infusion here so exciting times for both accounts and we find another shard been lucky as hell in 7 minutes of recording a video I found 3 shards for Three or four shards. I mean, I was just two shards off from getting big cast here. How many shards am I on now? 19. Not bad. Not bad. Maybe I'm lucky and I find um, both shards here. I really doubt it all. It'd be cool if I was. So, yeah. I'm being a pain as well today because obviously I go to college. I was in college from. Um, I leave at like half nine, half eight to catch the college bus, and I'm in the college then till today. I'm in the college till two, so yeah, it's really annoying. And obviously, I've got to catch the bus home then, which I usually don't get home till three. It's half past now, so I've been home for just over just under half an hour. So yeah, it is a bit of a pain, but I I can't play an awful lot compared. To other people but obviously I gotta put my education first because that's my future that will affect my long term future this won't so I don't find any of the final two shards but we'll probably go down to the elite just for resets so yeah no boats for that I've got to play money bank on both accounts I'm not doing too well here because as I said I ain't been able to play as much on either account because I've been in co college, uh, I think I'm going to seven shards here, which is awful. As you can see, we are on Randy Orton. Go through the team finds break down here. We've got Pokemon Master, which is sending these second account with 24 shards. We've got I Do Fits Fun. Go check out his channel, I Do Fits Fun, 21 shards. We've got Kenneth, very Dean shards. Go check out his YouTube channel, Kenneth Knight. We've got Leon, Iron Man with 17 shards. The Dark Lord of 13 shards. Antonio. He's got eight shards. Go and check out his channel, Antonio Rosano. The hero's got eight shards. Also, I've got seven shards. Got Stanley, 12, 15, six shards. And nice with zero shards. So, yeah, gonna get stuck into the gameplay now. Probably gonna play two or three bouts here before ending off the video. And then I've got to obviously put the layout on, upload it, etc. etc. So, I do fit fun. It's got the pro HPK here, which we'll use that. To work our way around beating this guy, put you there, Bray. Um, Gusev, we put Bray next to um, HBK, and then we put Brock there. So there we go, easy 5 4 victory here. So, yeah, but when I'm oh, 16 shards, there is had shards, um, shards spare. So, be how. Highly unfortunate not to pull a card here. Looks like nine shards remaining. Seven. What's the chance of me not pulling a shard? 
probably really really high by the looks of it and we're not we're not gonna find this ad big e summary please go away john cena so nope no shad on that turn maybe hopefully if i win both games here i should find a shad on this account before we end off the video it's great obviously as you saw i don't know about left on my main account so probably play money bank there whilst waiting for about not too sure yet and as i go along and the Shawn michaels gets called again probably just play here now until i get that reset from the um ring down board so we go cass we put cast there so easy five for victory here been there it's great did i claim yeah they claim cast so let's see oh and we get the pick double which is going to help us out a lot because we get double the picks but nadi and we've got manja bobby the brain he and then we find two shards double shard Find there so many shards have we found in total here team shard breakdown we have got 194 that's put me up to nine shots great so that's gonna be it for today guys i'll be back again soon with another edition of wb supercard i've been your host Aaron Mitchell from the hashtag broken ones and care of night yt signing off as always don't forget to leave a like comment and subscribe down below for more and as always guys don't forget peace